when we saw the people praying at Kathmandu prostrating themselves and I said they were Westerners I went up to the woman in the video and she's from Russia actually and she told me she was performing that prostration 700 times she had a digital ring on her finger I spoke to an Italian man and I said why are you exerting so much energy praying and he said it opens the mind body and soul towards the path for enlightenment and we owe all that fervent belief to one man he was born here in Lumbini on the dusty hot plains of southern Nepal his name was Siddhartha Gautama and from your year seven lessons in school you think well who's he on about well let us refresh your memory he became better known as Buddha and <coughs> His mother was traveling back to the palace, which is 20 miles west of here, and she was bathing in this pond, which has been preserved, corralled for posterity, and she felt that she was entering labor, and she left the pond behind us, and where that building is, it marks the birthplace of the great Siddhartha Gautama, the forecasted prince born from a queen and she left the lake and gave birth by holding a stick in the woods and inside that building is the exact place where Buddha was born and the temple which was built within a couple hundred years of his life and that means it was dated from about third cent second century BC to about one century AD and the authorities, the archaeologists are dead sure that Buddha was born here because there are in this area of subsequent remains of religious buildings which pilgrimage by rulers and emperors have built monuments testifying to the honor of the birth of Siddhartha Gautama who became Buddha and mother left here and went back to the palace and let's see if we can go to the palace and find any remains. Thank you very much indeed.